And if he's not, who are you following? There are only two choices, Jesus, the light of the world, and Satan, the prince of darkness. You are either a servant of Jesus Christ or a slave to sin and Satan. There is no middle ground. Hello, America. Who are we following as a nation? America must have a revival of righteousness if we are to survive as one nation under God. The Bible says all nations, that includes America, all nations that forget God are turned into hell. And this nation for decades has been doing its best to forget God. We've kicked the Ten Commandments out of schools. The Bibles have been taken out of schools. Faith in God has been taken out. Faith in God is now mocked. In the, in, the, in the public square. All nations that forget God. America must have a new beginning to honor the Bible few. Our founding fathers came here to Plymouth Rock in 1620 and established a nation with a covenant of God. They built it upon the foundation of the word of God. We must have a new beginning that recognizes that abortion in the United States in the eyes of God is murder. Yeah. We must have a new beginning where we bring back the Ten Commandments, when we kick out CRT, which is nothing but a racial warfare, communism 101, kick it out the back door, tell the teachers you you are the parents of these children, and you have an input to what they do and do not hear in the public.